What up, man? Thank you for tuning in to the Fat Show Podcast. We're also at, we also have the video available on YouTube. Um, it's at the Fat Show. Check out the Facebook and the Instagram pages, man. We have videos on those pages as well. And just a reminder, that was YouTube, the F.A.T.Show. On Facebook, at the Fat Show Awake. Instagram, at the Fat Show Awake. Twitter, at the Fat Show Awake. And if you want to go ahead and download the Podbean uh, app, you can get the, you can get us uh, at thefatshow.podbean.com. Um, when you check out our video, man, go ahead and subscribe, leave a comment, let us know, you know, let us know what you think about the show. And as always, man, we appreciate and love y'all, man. Take care, wash your hands, be safe out there, man. Appreciate y'all. Yep, it's your boy Ross, man. The Fat Show, baby. Y'all already know what it is. Choo. Welcome to the Building Bird Chronicles. Show, fat Show, Fat Podcast. Well, cheers, man. <laughs> 300, man. What's up, my hoes? You well, feel me? y'all already know right, what it is. Right. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, man. We're going we're gonna, uh, we're gonna to go ahead and entertain the world with this shit, man. <laughs> Look at that clout. <laughs> hey, hold on. Let me let me matter if you right, you right. Little ass clap. Let me do that again. Hold on. This boy hit that mark. All right. Check this out. <laughs> Y'all already know what it is, man. It's Wednesday. Motherfucking yeah. May the 20th in this hole. Yep. And uh you working with the motherfucking fat show, man. You know what I'm saying? I am your host, Mr. Ronald Chump. <laughs> you dig know what I'm saying? Uh, <laughs> hey, make America uh, black again. And I got my boys with me. One of my boys is tripping right now. But it's all good. We're gonna, start, we're, we're, gonna, we're gonna charge it to his mind, not his not his heart. I got my <laughs> I got my nigga from Tuskegee, Alabama, my nigga Kendall, aka Rex No Flex, get shot in the neck, over chip, respect, chip, you know chip. what I'm saying? Smooth 300. Right. Hey, hey I got my boy from Fairfield Beach, Florida, representing Broward County, yeah. H-E-O know in this hole. Uh. My nigga Ross, Brandon Rollins, hey. What up? <laughs> yeah. And of course, what up? last but not least, yeah. Yeah, hailing out of Orange yeah. Mound, Tennessee. Two rounds, three down. Your favorite career. My nigga Poop, yeah, my man, a.k.a. Yeah, um, Rick James. You know yeah, what I'm saying? Ain't no talk today. Understand hey, me, man. Yo, with snicker face ass nigga smooth as hell <laughs> on the show. I ain't mad at him, though. I mean, I'm still, right. I'm still, you know, a little rough. Your nigga will be clean on Monday with a taper, yeah, man, because I can't do this shit no more. I'm risking COVID, bro. Fuck it. You say your hair got COVID. What? Nah. <laughs> oh, my bad, bro. My bad, bro. My, my, my bad. I must have heard that wrong. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, nigga. Baby ass right. here. Oh, no. My bad. My bad. I must have heard that wrong. Yes, yeah, sir. How you doing, sir? Talk to me. Talk to me, man. What's good? You don't get your Dick Tracy suit having ass back. Relax. Nah, 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 man. Relax. Take it in. Squeeze this. Relax. Shit, man. Early <laughs> checking. <laughs> <laughs> On the fat. <laughs> yeah. okay, what's Do up? Five thousand years in a jump. <laughs> I told you I'd check your way in my field. Thought he was safe. Nigga was get. Nigga was getting on poop pie pre show. Brother, brother, I'm. <laughs> Uh, okay, bro. My bad, man. Just you chopped up, bro. I see you fresh as hell, man. Get my feelings on. Face, like face looking like runny dog shit, bro. I'm just saying, you you, you fresh. <laughs> <laughs> I, ain't, I ain't even mad. <laughs> I ain't, no I ain't, more I ain't even mad though. <laughs> you, 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 you came on the show. You came on the show with the ninja mask on. I knew something was up. Right. You know what I'm saying? My nigga was stealth mode in this motherfucker, didn't he? <laughs> <laughs> nigga found out yeah. 
looking like a camel toe in the face. Yeah, take that off. But it's all good. <laughs> yeah. you know, we here, we here as one. You know what I'm Damn. saying? Damn, hey, bro, really. you really getting off? <laughs> you really, bro? I ain't gonna even fly. Cause. <laughs> hey, the last two shows, cause you really been checking me, huh? You said my hey. forehead look like a <laughs> kneecap. This man is not playing. Not really? playing. <laughs> look, look, man, you got to understand, oh, man. man. Listen, for the folks listening, y'all got to understand. This nigga been checking me for fucking years. And it wasn't nothing I could do about it, cause I couldn't I couldn't check like that. Now I figured the motherfucking formula out. So Man, you 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 did more than me the formula. Out. Hey, well I'm proud of you. <laughs> hey, it's, it's the jacket, cause it's it's the jacket. Well I'm proud hey. of you, boy. It's this little, it's on a chunk. Hey, it's I'm, this I'm little slick, bit of ass. I'm slick ready to fight. <laughs> 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 What's up? <laughs> What's up? We got a fat show boxing match. No. <laughs> What's up? Hey, we'll take, yeah. we can take that bitch back to Grove. I ain't tripping. Yeah, see? We can go all the way back to Grove, baby. 12 years ago. But hey, yeah. man, we can only go 12 seconds. I I, I can't get hurt bullshitting no. like that. You know what I mean? Yeah. My job needs my arms, all right? My, I, I got to be able to lift limbs, you understand? I'll give you five, cuz. It's like 2008, no more. Yeah, I tried to wrestle with my little brothers, and boy, I passed out. Some of them don't even know. Yeah, man, I, I figured out that the saying, we ain't little no more, can really go the wrong way if you ain't in shape. Young nigga tell you you ain't little no more? And, and, and he really been out there in them ways. It's over with. That's why I'm shooting. That's why I'm shooting, motherfuckers, man. You know, I ain't, I ain't scared. Look, I ain't scared to fight. I, I'm not scared to fight. Bang bang. But, but, I'm not. Look, man. I'm an average Joe now. All right, I go to work and I'm a dad. Right. Man, I'm not finna fight no motherfucking athlete. This nigga be running and eating raw eggs and shit every day. You know, right. nah, bro. Mm -hmm. You got to play. Go on about your business here. You good. Let me, let me buy you Nigga, want to pull off his shirt? Got, got 12 oh, packs of shit? I'm not finna fight you, bro. You finna get shot. But at the same time, yeah, nigga, ain't, a nigga ain't finna embarrass me. He ain't finna hold me. You know what I'm saying? That's what you gonna <laughs> That's learn. That's what I'm saying, nigga. You gonna really learn. Good, For real. Yeah. I've been waiting all my life. And I no. had to wait till I got, I had to wait till I got old enough to not care about a lot of shit to accept something like this. But at this age, I want to smack the shit out of somebody and not care if I get knocked out behind it. <laughs> nah, I ain't, I, ain't gonna never, I ain't gonna never not care about that shit. Nah, all I'm saying is, if it get to a point where I'm fighting somebody extremely bigger than me, and I know I, I ain't got much of a win, you gonna remember. <laughs> <laughs> It ain't going to stop there. I ain't even just saying I'm going to lose. But what I'm saying is the first punch thrown in that fight is going to be monumental. <laughs> yeah, yeah, nah, for real though. Nigga can kick my ass and all they going to be saying was, boy, he smacked the shit out of your big ass, boy. <laughs> I'd beat his ass like that too. <laughs> real, I'd still be kicking his ass <laughs> where he slapped you. And he, and he backhands you. Bro, he treated you like a bitch. Hey, I'll be the nigga instigating some shit. I see that. Real. That nigga treated you like a bitch, boy. He Man, ain't even feeling shit. good. And you licking my nigga ass fucked up, bro. Bro, bro what you see like, how you beat his ass like that and you bleeding? Right. From a slap? My nigga, your face soft or something. You gotta be careful, man, because I, I found out I found out running with a group of niggas like, you know, size didn't mean shit. Yo, man. Nah. We, we was downtown and, and hold on. What, what we got there? Couple mm -hmm. niggas froze. Ah, right, okay. No. What the fuck? Ah, right, okay, there you go. Now nah, it was I can't. 
Ross got that damn thing yeah, on the screen, line. man, and that shit, that shit. What? That, yo, picture what you do in the Shawn Michaels stands. Hey, Sam. Yeah. Hey, man. Look, uh, <clears throat> look uh, man, man. Them wrinkled yeah. ass flip flops he got on in that picture. <laughs> man, <laughs> man, 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 man. Oh, oh, hey, let me, let me, let me see this picture. <laughs> well, your ass look like you got parachute pants on. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm finna check the shit out your little man. mohawk ass. <laughs> hey, I got that picture. Hold on, bro. I got bro. that picture in the cup holder in my car right goddamn now. I ought to go get that shit. Leave that shit alone, bro. Nah, go get that shit. Nah, tomorrow, Thursday. Don't worry. I Leave forgot that last alone. week. Your old lad gonna forget about it. <laughs> <laughs> lad. Hey, my kids ever get in trouble. I'm gonna show up to the school like getting yes. being that bitch. Right. I'm having people crazy. I ain't even gonna go up to the school when school starts. I'm gonna let Tasha do all that. And then I'm gonna show up doing the conferences with an accent. You know what I'm saying? Fuck them all the way up, nigga. <laughs> Look, like, you, you, gotta, been... you gotta put that earpiece on that come out the hair. Do you talking about yeah, 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 yeah. The, 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 hey, the first the Bluetooth. Job, the Jabra? Bro, got the little uh oh, yeah. I'm the, going I'm the, going there with the with uh, the with jeans the, on yeah. with the you know with the nah, tight shoes. I'm, I'm in that bitch with the overalls and the uh and the church shoes that that's mid top with the mid top church shoes. <laughs> <laughs> nah, not the mid. Yeah, the mid <laughs> snake skin church shoes with the strap nah. buckle on them bitches. Boy, <laughs> ball up. Hey, and they gonna, gonna be too, about getting in trouble no more. They gonna be too big. It's gonna have a crease at the top. And, and, <laughs> hey, and, I, and I'm gonna be doing. Shit. And I'm gonna be doing the James Brown in the hall. I'm gonna embarrass the shit out of him. mind you, my, bro. Mind you, just don't know what he got coming for him. The older he get, he want to act up in school. All right, cool. You think of ass whooping or something? Bet. I'm going to come have lunch with with you tomorrow. I might, I might end. Cameras. He better I hope like he don't this. do something. Hey, for real. He And he better hope he don't get in some real trouble. I, nigga, I'll fuck around and shit on myself and come sit right oh, there in his class. Nah, nah. nah. <laughs> You're going too far now, boy. Right. <laughs> this nigga here. Yeah. This nigga taking me to another level, cause. What's that? What's that? What's that smell? My kids nigga, I shit on myself. Learn, <laughs> kids don't learn. I shit on myself. I'm nigga get, and what? Look, Ross, being in school telling them. I'm going to be in the school telling them. Shit, we, ain't got, we can't afford no toilet paper. What I was supposed to do? Mmm. Mmm. you going to be mad, boy. Fuck it up, man. Hey, what's up, though? He's different. He's been running ready to kill his goddamn self. Man. No. What's up, bro? Trying to, trying to bring, a, bring Joe Japp in? <coughs> yes, let's bring in Brother Japster. Right. See what see he got he, to say. Yeah. See, see, see what he got to say about this story that I got to tell y'all about my homeboy, man. This nigga fucked up. He let me know that it's expensive as hell to be comfortable in prison. So I ain't never going. I ain't made it there yet. And I definitely ain't going there. That nigga told me it cost twelve hundred dollars to get a cell phone. In what? Mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah. <laughs> what? You want if you want the up to date? <laughs> yeah. Right. What? Right, here, come, here come Joe Jack right now. Man. You trying to check his ass. Oh man. Where this nigga right here ain't got. We, oh, ladies and gentlemen, we got Joe Jump. What's up, man? Plumbing three hundred man. A uh, smooth, criminal looking ass nigga. <laughs> <laughs> hey, un hey, unmute your phone, Jap. It's at the bottom. At the bottom. Click the bottom. The, the bottom, bottom left. <laughs> Damn. We can't hear you, cuz. We can't hear you. It's hey, at the bottom. At the, the bottom. bottom. It's a it's a microphone. Make sure the microphone ain't got a slash in it. Yeah, yeah, at the bottom. Look. There it is. It's a microphone at the bottom. Connect the audio. Right, you there get go. to the show. We got right. Joe Jap. Ah, right, this okay. nigga on silent. Unmute the motherfucker, man. 
Yeah, unmute it now. And cut the volume up, brother. Cut the volume up. Hug line, nigga. Shut up, See? nigga. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> ladies and gentlemen, ladies uh -huh. and gentlemen, give a warm welcome, brother Joe Jab. Yeah. What up, what up? Yeah. What up? What up? My what nigga me? from Milwaukee, hailing in Ripley, Tennessee, came oh, to Greenberg, climbed hey. 300. What's up, brother? Uh, right. Right. Never mind, brother. Go ahead. I, I was just, I was just giving them all the attributes, man. Smooth three hundred. Y'all know what it is, Mister Plumber. So, hey, before we get started, hey, my nigga Raw, why are these yeah. niggas dressed up and we sit up? Really <laughs> oh, right. oh, no, uh, I got on a goddamn party. <laughs> sir, sir, um, uh, uh, normally, <laughs> normally this would be Uno on the show. But tonight I'm taking over, and my name is Ronald Chump. Yeah. Ronald Chump. Okay. Ronald, Ronald uh -huh. Chump. Ronald Chump. And, um, <laughs> and if you hear anything that sounds robot-y, it's just Kendall's Wi-Fi. We're going to get through that. We're going to get through that. Slide over. If you yeah. slide over, you'll see him. If you slide over a screen, he chilling right there. Him. Big nigga beater. Okay? Big nigga beater. Oh, you ain't enough? <laughs> Kendall ain't no, in there. He, he's on here. You gotta, you gotta swipe over one more page. That nigga just chilling though. Yeah, yeah, yeah he chilling. We all in yeah. here together, brother. The screen ain't gonna work <laughs> for all of us to be together. So. Oh, okay. You know. Well, Plumber Three Hundred, Kendall, you know, you know, you my nigga. Holla at me. Hear me, brother. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Um, right. Hey, on this, huh? yeah, they don't like that Plumber oh, Three Hundred, huh? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Uh, the fact that, like, this is the first time, it, this is the first time in history that H.E.O. was outnumbered. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Three class you having that, boy. ass niggas, man. <laughs> All them goddamn people y'all had in them classrooms, only five of them was really okay. Exactly, bro. That's what, and that's what, the that's, the, that's, that's what we're trying to get at, bro. It was only five of us that was with it. It was, and that's at the end of the day, it was problem. 10 of y'all, 15 of y'all. It is. Wait, no, not, wait. Not, not including me. Fight. Not including hey, did me. Did y'all know, did y'all know we had a crackhead in Plumman? Say it again. Did y'all know we had a crackhead in Plumman? Crackhead. Whew. You got me thinking. All right, cool. I'm going to tell y'all. I believe his name was James. James, 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 James. He was a light-skinned brother, and he had braids. Real skinny. Yes. I think I know you're talking about. So check this um, out. I want to tell y'all something fucked up. This is how I found out that the brother used cocaine. Y'all remember Normandy? The yeah, cock eyed yeah. girl that Solo used to yeah. be all crazy in love with? All right. Yeah. So Normandy started messing with James. James got her hot. About a few days before she went into the military, and she tested positive for cocaine. Wow. Damn. Wow. Who the fuck is James? So her like bro, messed up because the nigga wanted to get her high. Bro, I think she had to go in some kind of program, uh, you know what I'm saying, or had to wait and clean her system before she could actually join. Or some crazy shit like that, but I, he was from Kentucky, hey, Poopa, bro. Hold <laughs> <laughs> yeah, on, that, that don't make sense, though, bro. What don't make sense? How she, how she knew she was gonna go to the military and smoked a couple days for that. Well, that part I don't know. I guess she, she, she was did, probably I, she probably did cocaine already, bro. Or or or, or he or he laced the shit. Yeah, but why was, my thing is, why would she smoke a couple of days before knowing she's going to get pissed at you? That's another point. Okay, well, now, I'm, I'm, I'm not up. trying to, okay. Did I don't know go, like that. Did just, she just go to, to the military after John Court or from John Court? After. She was on this shit. Now, listen. It just don't make now, sense. It don't make no, sense. Okay, man. okay, okay. You get a high cover. Listen, she got her stuff high. but, 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 <laughs> your Jap, Jap has a point. <clears throat> he probably laced it because if you think about it, she was smoking weed already. We right. can't just True. say she was on that. We know she was smoking weed, but what she told me was she didn't know it was laced. So 
Boom. I understand. Sorry, I understand. You, that. you, you sounded too my, intelligent, my, Donald Trump. Right, you gotta dumb it down. Back to the case. Right. You the fool. Well, this whole situation. <laughs> this whole situation seems a little fishy to me. So no matter how intelligent I sound, it doesn't make sense. <laughs> it's a hoax. <laughs> it, doesn't, it doesn't make sense. And you know why it doesn't make sense? Because she tried to make it seem like the cocaine is what kept her from getting an army at the time. No, bitch. It was the marijuana as well. So I guess she just needed a finger to blame. Hold on, she wait. Probably, she only tested she only tested for cocaine. She only tested positive for cocaine. Well, she was only surprised that she tested positive for cocaine. <laughs> She did that shit herself. <laughs> bro, she did oh, that shit. Time, well, oh, I was thinking, Martin. I was like, well, her eyes was kind of weird, so maybe she didn't see like, <laughs> the right Most likely, bro. <laughs> this nigga retarded. Hey, man, <laughs> hey, look, I know I, I love Solo with all my heart, but that man had the nerve to look me in my eye and act like he didn't know what I was talking about when I was asking him about her eyes. He gonna tell me, bro, I don't know what, what you're talking doing? about. What? <laughs> you go over that. Follow nobody. I don't know. Motherfucker, <laughs> you go over that a little bit. That's I I heard, like that. When he said that, all I heard was, "I love my baby mama. I never let her go." Like, that's hey. That's it, baby mom. No, but I'm just saying, he didn't give a fuck. <laughs> like Cat Williams right. said, either you were small and got big. Oh, you were big, big and, and got small. small. Oh, we what? fucking either way. Either way, we fucking. So. Either way. <laughs> Listen, come here, Tiger. And then, <laughs> and then, you know, we, we we had to go with the options we was given at Job Corp. It ain't like a bus of bad right. bitches came every Tuesday. Niggas was reading right. them names, hoping right. that the face was as cute as the name. Man, motherfucker was just going to right. the floor. That's why Lord, I was, that's why, that's why well, I was hey, called Fresh Meat Tuesday I'm, and not Bad Bitch Tuesday. Hey, I'm a humble motherfucker. I ain't gonna lie. I had the ugliest bitch ever in Jail Court. I ain't gonna even study nah, in my whole life. Nah, in my nah, whole is, life. Nah. I had a couple of them. <laughs> I had a couple of them. No. Nah. But nah. The ugliest oh. bitch in my whole life. I had a Jail Court. I ain't trying hey. to talk shit, poop out, but we, I mean. No, no, no. I got this. We, I got we this. discussed. Hey, hey, y'all probably know who it is. I know you know who it is. Nah, we, we, I know you, nah, you know who it is, too. Who it is, too? No. Jeff, I remember that real little skinny motherfucker dog. No. <laughs> what was her name? Hey, I, I can't remember. It, she used to walk up. Hey, she used to run around. Jasper, Jasper. That's all she <laughs> That was the ugliest motherfucker ever, boy. Huh. Who? I can't remember her name, dog. I can't remember her name. I swear I can't. Hey. Huh. Real skinny. Hold, hold up. up. Hold up. What's up, Jeff. What's up, I'm gonna tell y'all. I gotta tell y'all. Okay, Jeff went ahead and admitted it. I'm, 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 I'm gonna keep it a thousand, bro. Um, she was uglier than Genevieve. This ain't working. Genevieve. Genevieve. Oh shit. Oh, Genevieve. Oh, that was. I forgot about Poopy. Oh, Poopy. I forgot about that. One. No, no, no. This ain't about me. This is about you. Hey, listen. Listen. <laughs> Listen, <laughs> hold on. In Poopa's defense, in, in, in Poopa's defense, hold on, hold on, y'all. <laughs> in Poopa's defense, Poopa has already admitted to this. So, okay. so we can't. So, so, so uh, when Poopa said this ain't about him, I gotta, I gotta. But look, Ross, <laughs> you motherfucker, you started this, Ross. We, me and Poopa knew where you was going with what you said. So don't put this on me. I just he, he so, said he said he had an ugly. I just I just <laughs> hold on. Hey guys. Ross, hold I on. I have to take a quick commercial break. I'm bad, bro. I'm too. Ross, you done had some fucked up motherfuckers too, man. See, you, I wouldn't have like died for we Ross though. That, I, I wouldn't nah, have yeah. Nah, yeah. Ross oh. had a whole grandma. Damn. <laughs> she wasn't that. She oh. was 24. She was solo aid, nigga. She was like, hey, I had that little cross eyed little bitch too, though. Hey, I had some fucked up bitches in Jaw Corps, bro. Nah, nah, but the <laughs> ugliest one up there was Jessica Lita. Man, Man please. Said. Hold on, bro. I, I can't remember who you talking about, Joseph. I mean, ja but for real, though. Hey, like, because hey, I was there when you were there. She used to kick it with that little chunky, 
Mexican motherfucker and that tall, ugly bitch, black bitch from Florida, bro. <laughs> it was them three. The one I was fucking with her name, what was her name? Uh, yeah, I be right back. Shit, what was her name, dog, man? I can't even remember my name, Fupa. Damn, I know who you talking about, the Mexican junk, because she used she to go with real Kobe. Chunky. She was going. Yeah, she used to go, she, yeah, she used to go with Kobe. Yep, yep, yep. Yeah. It was her. But, the chick I was fucking with, and that tall, ugly bitch. She was so ugly, bro. She probably was the ugly bitch in John Court. They all three used to always kick it. I ain't gonna bother something. I can't even see her face. I remember, hey, I wish, uh, you remember, Damn, uh, yeah. you remember Gordon, them, right? Who? Jason Gordon. Yeah. Regina, yeah. And Regina, all right. So that was my roommate in um Independence, me and Jason. Before Michael came up in there, Michael Bam, Michael ended up coming in later. Yeah. Uh, Jason, remember, bro, I used to sneak the girl in inside mm -hmm. out the damn window, bro. I can't remember her name, bro, all the time, bro. He said he came in one day, see number ass hanging out the window. I was like, oh, my bad, nigga. I was trying to. <laughs> <laughs> that shit crazy. Damn, bro. Jeff. Jeff, I, I got on my soul. I forgot. I got some about stories, that, man. Bro. I got some stories. What's her name? Oh, no. Bro, I name? can't. I, I can't think, bro. But I just, just remember because she was. What's she was skill, right? bro. And she from Union City, bro. Bro, what's yep. her, her skill? You know what bro, I'm talking think, about too. Bro. She was. Uh, I think she was in facility maintenance. Yep. Yep. Got to go over there. We used to be there. Ooh, thank you. Yeah. We yeah. was right next door, and the bathrooms in the middle. Oh my god! Man, come on, man. Oh man, my! I was in, I was an ATO bro, and I, I even I ended up I ended man. up in the motherfucking bathroom a couple of times. Oh, oh, I, wish, I swear I wish I knew her name, bro. She had the. But the crazy part was I knew her before John Core, bro. And when she came up in that motherfucker, she said that. So I used she to be on the track team. She, I used to be on the oh, track team and man. shit. I used to throw discs and shot put and shit. You know what I'm saying? And well, she and she used to uh she used to be on track man. team too. I can't think of her name for shit. Well, ladies, what we're realizing is that at Job Corps, most of us fuck with some that ugly women. <laughs> I mean, but you think was, about, you think about. Had, her name was Carmen. Carmen, you see this, baby? I still remember you. You was a fine, fine. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie to you. I um, know who you're talking about. Carmen is. Carmen Blue? Yeah, I know you're talking about. Ooh. She was short. Uh, nah, the, she was tall, the... boy, tall. Well, you know, I love them tall motherfuckers, bro. Hold on, no. Carl Wanky, bro. The Carmen I remember was the show. It was, I think it was another was, one. You must be Latino. talking about Carmen San Diego. That's who she <laughs> <laughs> This dude. Oh, my yeah. God. Uh, Ronald Trump with the, Ronald Trump. Y'all like Latino. <laughs> you said her name Carmen, and she Latino. I mean, shit. Nah, when I was talking about she, she chocolate as a motherfucker, straight from Florida, bro. Man, I as wish dude. I knew that girl's name, Jeff, man. The other one, the cross eyed one. Damn, no, bro. You talking about the cross eyed one? No, I'm talking about the skinny black girl. <sighs> I, I remember, bro. Hey, bro. Yeah, that was the ugliest one I had, though. I, I can't try. look. Yeah, she look, must be it's insignificant because, nigga, you remember everybody's fucking name, nigga. Who, me? Yeah, nigga. Bro, I know, bro. But this man be remember. You remember the dude that was in the in the class, and I'm like, why the fuck you remember that nigga name? But this nigga know the, the JFK motherfucking. <laughs> oh, JFK, <laughs> Lance Armstrong, this nigga. nigga. But this nigga George knew all Moore. that shit. I nah, mean, but he knew the little chant and shit, bro, for JFK. Bro, bro what you? I was the fucking president. I, I, I was I too. Led, I forgot about I this led shit, the man. chant. Don't you remember? I led the chant. I was the nigga going, hold up. I was I was doing all that. Bro. Bro, I understand I mean, that, bro. I bro, got that, bro. I am proud. I was too. Hell. Bro, I hey, was here, bro. I was the president of the gym for about like a month too. <laughs> That's about it. No. Um, <laughs> um, hold on one second. Um, oh, here um, we go. Um, Mr. Quaterio, was there something that you had to say a second ago, sir? I believe I heard you throw. What'd you like to call a check at me? And I want to hear it. I said, yo, little uncle's ass, how you got to leave the chance? Oh. That's what I said. Heard that that any, any other time, I'd have to be a complete ass, but I have to agree with you. Yes, I was very fucking happy that I got to leave the chance. <laughs> 
We won, nigga. <laughs> we did, though. Yeah, we did, though. We did. You remember when lights went out? So, um, Jeff, since, you're a guest on, this, okay. since, since Jeff is a guest on the show, I have a question I want to ask you. Are you familiar with the Webby video that was put out a few days ago in response to Young Bootsy? Okay, I seen the video he was talking about. <laughs> niggas Basically. don't even want to say. <laughs> now listen, All right, listen. I don't niggas don't even want to say. I understand. Bar, man, I, I understand. It. We're men. Certain things masculinity I, won't allow. So allow me. The man said that he was going to stick his dick in another man's ass like a bitch <laughs> and make him holler like a hoe. And but before he said all uh, that, this is what the man said. He said. He said, I looked at the thing and it said, uh, uh, Webby, uh, what it say, gay, uh, happy, mine, shut your puss ass. <laughs> and then everything on, after that he said was completely unacceptable. However, my question is, is it still okay to listen to his music as a heterosexual male? <laughs> All right, so I'm not gonna answer that question. I'm just gonna bring you another instance, right? All right. Yeah. Wait, hold on, sir. I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't think I can allow you to come on, come on. Hold on, bro. Hold on. We will. You will answer this question after you uh, say what you're gonna say. Continue. Deflective ass nigga. Ass nigga. If this nigga don't answer my question, kick him the fuck out of here. We ain't going for that. All right, all right, take it. Go for that. Let me ask, do you do you still listen to R. Kelly? Yes, faithfully. You're he. And you ain't no rape bridge. No, no. <laughs> 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 you know what I'm saying? So, you know. Now I, know. I got a lot of memories on, on that's when I was there, bro. That's when I was down there, bro. You see what I'm saying? So I got a lot of memories, man. I grew up, you know. Low and dodo, come on now. I can't help it. The shit come on, I'm going to sing the shit, bro. I ain't going to even stun, bro. I don't approve of the shit that he said. But the but, shit come on, man. Goddamn, what can I say? Now, are you, are you going to think the lyrics are meant for niggas now? <laughs> come on. <laughs> oh, man. I'm just bro. saying, bro. That's a legit question, though. Hey, man, I'm starting to, I'm starting to think that that whole... Got a bitch, suspect, nigga. My now, my little And that was one of my favorite songs. Oh, bro. I got Do you know how many times I hit females and shit off that damn song, bro? Come on, man. Man. I got something to say. Ooh, you might not know what she might do to you. Come on now. Come on now. That's the shit. Hey, a look, too much, hope. Check this out. Check this out. Now, this is oh, how I feel shit. about it. Now, hey. correct me if I'm wrong, or if y'all agree, so you agree. Anything after when he went on BET and told him, like, get your bitch, man, everything before that is okay. Anything after that, that's when he went fucking sideways. I can listen to everything behind that, but everything before that, no. All right. I'm not. I can I can definitely understand that. So let me ask you this: If R. Kelly gets released from jail and makes something new, is it alright to listen to that? Nope. <laughs> nope. Nah. Right. Now, this I can't do it. No, hold on now. Wait, no, wait, no. wait, wait. I can't we, do I can't, it. Well, hold on, but hold on. We but, can't but, say but, it's so different. We can't say it different is. because because Jap used R. Kelly's situation to compare the Webby's prior to answering the question. So this is really the same thing. This is the same thing. No, Damn check this out. Check this out. Okay. I don't agree with what R. Kelly did Maybe on all that shit. Right. But check this out. It's not all R. Kelly fault. So you mean Definitely. tell me, I don't know my daughter gone that she with Bruh. R. Kelly, but you said that you talked to her. And she, yeah, I'm with R. Kelly. And you didn't call the police. You didn't go to the house. But it's like when a check stopped, it's time to do that. So it's like that's what I said too, though. 
Yeah, he's now, wrong. Now, he's wrong for doing what he did yes. because they underage. So he should have never did that because they underage. Right. But that other. So part, who's the bigger who? who Who's more wrong in that entire situation? I tell it for sure. I tell it. No, R. nigga, they parents. parents. R. Kelly and their parents. Nah, they parents. Nah, both. I tell it's a grown ass man. Listen like to a 13 me. All right, all right, bro. All right, check this yeah. out. Check this I'm out. I'm just saying. My daughter's 14, my nigga. If, <laughs> if, I, if I have knowledge, I, it's I my fault. But that nigga still grown ass man, fucking 14. Look though, but look though, I understand. But as a parent, as a parent, yeah. you got to think if somebody you know is interested. In your kid, like get his hands. Re regardless of what could become of them, if you was to allow the bullshit, you gotta nip shit like that in the bud at the door. No, no, definitely. Right, definitely. right. You right. can't no, even. So. You know what I'm saying? You, 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 you gotta, you gotta watch certain people at cookouts and no, family bro, you, gotta watch, nigga, you gotta watch certain people you know what anywhere, nigga. And that's what I'm saying. Really? So, so, so really? it's like, it's like a man couldn't come to me. You know, my favorite rapper is T.I. T.I. couldn't come to me and, and, and M of 15, you know what I'm saying? And he'd be like, let yeah, him roll with me, you know what I'm saying? I'm going to bring it into no. a star. Bruh, and then, and I'm thinking to myself, you know what I'm saying? Damn, man, we down bad and fucked up, man. We could be living large if we right. let up. So I'm going to sacrifice. Hell no. Nah. Nah. No. Hell no, nah, man. Absolutely. <laughs> yeah. Hit his ass in his room, and, Straight and, up. And, exactly. And then it's like, okay. Man, you're going to so show me. This was more than one girl. So you mean to tell me it's about six or eight fucked up individuals okay with letting right. their kids go off with a man? And the, I would I would completely understand if... If like not understand, but it'll make more sense if like these girls was R. Kelly's first victims, but they not. That man right. had a that man right. had a reputation of shit like this prior you to hit the it on the nail. situation. You hit it on the nail. So, you know what I mean? So shit, it's like y'all knew what y'all was doing. <laughs> right. That was right. Shit to say. <laughs> yeah, bro. Right. bro. That's crazy. That's bro. all it was. They was, she was, they was getting that check. When that shit shut, cut short, they got mad and shit. All about money, shit. Bro. Black, All about money. That right. shit set black people back so far. Bro. Come on. Woo. I bet the Pope, I bet the Pope and them had a field that. day making little uh, Catholic songs about R. Kelly and shit. Man. <laughs> they, they talk all that How? shit about us. <laughs> Nigga, please. Man. They but, fucked uh, up, though. I'm they sorry, They fucked bro. up, dog. They fucked up, I, bro. Like if you let your motherfucking I'm, kid I'm go, I'm fucking with R. Kelly in the old school because his music, you know, puts you in there. Bumping, it's easy. bumping. It's easy. But you know, I don't, I don't see him making nothing else. I, <laughs> so, I'm not gonna I'm be looking for believer. it. I'm gonna put it like that. Look, I ain't man, gonna be looking for it. I am a firm believer I, of not giving a fuck what these celebrities do in their real life. Make the right. good music so that I can vibe to it. You if see, I meet you, if I meet you in person, if I get that opportunity. Then I can get the judgment of how you are if I want to like you as a person. Like if I met, you, like I I met Ti when I was a youngster. DJ Drummer and them had this uh 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 it was a CD store, and they had like a little booth set up where all the up and coming rappers released their mixtapes and shit there. It was a big thing down there. I think I was about fourteen. So I met T.I. and he was a cool dude. He became my favorite rapper because I met him as a, you know what I'm saying? Before he got real big, I met him. He was cool and blase, blase. But shit, if, if I just liked his music and I never met him ever in my life and he did some fucked up shit, like I can't be like, oh, I can't listen to your music no more. You done some fucked up shit. I don't know nothing about this person to judge him for real, but. I can't support rapists. I can't support child molesters. But it's, I don't know, bro. It's just like my mom and them used to talk about that shit when I was a kid about how R. Kelly was fucked up like that. So clearly the nigga been fucked up. And motherfuckers accepted it to a certain extent. It got to a point where to that check stop. Check coming out. Yeah. All right, but hold on, hold on. Hold on. The end of it to that check stop. That's what that's the thing with the way. Hold up. Uno, I do not agree with what you just said. No, that's right. Let me hear it. Check this out. You said that you can't listen to Wicked no more because you know what he did, what he did. That's in his personal life. So it means you have to still listen to Webby if he drop a CD today. 
You right. Just like, they're just you're like right. me. I, I, well, I never listen to six nines, but you know, so it, it ain't, it ain't. <laughs> Uno you know, I never listen to them. I'm not gonna listen Uno to. Uno bumping that shit. Uno, I see bro, it on Facebook. Bro, I'm that nigga, bro. That listen nigga says so. Six nine six. new song ain't bumping. <laughs> it was a question. <laughs> Niggas take shit out of context. Too easy. <laughs> nigga, don't it lie, was on don't Facebook, lie. nigga. I seen. Don't, yeah, we talked about lie. last summer, Listen, nigga. What you talking when I, about? When, when, I, word, out of context. You know when I heard, heard the song, now. what the, the 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 bro? The first the first word the nigga says, I tell a nigga, don't dick ride. You listening to this shit? My kids you like, like the nigga, bro. Nah, you like that nigga too. Just be real, cuz. Stop putting oh, it on Emma. Uh, Stop right. putting it on Emma and Munju. Bro. You be in there with the shit. I don't, about, yeah. I don't know them about half of these new niggas, man. Bro, nigga I don't. Man. I don't. I listen to gospel music, bro. Nigga, you look like you be in there while he on the screen talk. Get him blood. Get him blood. Nah, he not in Trey Gangster, bro. He's not, not there no more. I'm he a West Side nigga, no bro. <laughs> he not there no more. I don't really know what it is. Here you go. Imply, <laughs> but I don't. Know. Oh, I believe you. <laughs> <laughs> I don't like it one bit. And when I say I don't like it one bit, that means I don't like it at all. Like <laughs> not a little bit. Hey man, you want me to go get that nigga, man? No, Ajax. You talking about camel toe face ass nigga? Yeah. You see, I go get him now. Let me go get him. He'll pull up on what? What? No, Ajax. Hey. I got another question I want to ask you, Jeff. What up? I heard that some kind of way, them two crackers that killed Ahmad down in Georgia might get off this case. Huh. Well, because how that shit gonna happen? Be, hold on, it's on camera. You know, they ain't no cops. You're right. The killing is on camera. But when Ross, Ross, you was going over the whole list of uh, things that had to occur when uh, citizens arrest or something like that. Yeah. So it was something that surfaced about. Um, you know the little construction site, what you know what what they said where the they really stopped by the house and mm -hmm. stuff like that. So it yeah. was something else that surfaced that had said that he was actually inside. There's no footage of this though. There's no footage, but I'm only saying this because it's always something like that. Well, now story you're ready. like this, yeah, you got they it. might they might not get. Well, all give me that, Kyle. But they're gonna try. They give me, they give nah, me he's that. not gonna get off, bro. They, 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 it's it. All the, all the, everything around the situation is fucked up, bro. After so, they, 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 that, that footage, that footage of some, of some, a black male in the house. I seen it. It's not you can't tell who it is. The, the homeowner never, never established who it was. They never found who it was. The dude, the dude that shot uh, um, Ahmad. He chased. He said he chased somebody through the house, out of the house. By the time the police got there, they were gone. That night, that that that, that, that video, that video you talking about. But really? everything, yeah, bro. So that, that was that was in January. That was that was, that was my man. That was in January. So then, um, the that day he went in there. They, it's, it's, it's video of him looking around and then taking off. And then the nine one one call is Travis. Talking about oh he's he's leaving the house right now, and uh, the um, the the nine one one the lady she's like but what is what is he doing what is he doing that's illegal he didn't he never answered that when they got there it, it's clear it, it's clear and this this is all explained from a lawyer he's like when he got there it's clear that he was he was running he went to go around the truck and he was he was somebody with uh, um was facing him with a shotgun. So that was self defense for 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 a mod, and it should be he should he they should win that case easily. They should be in jail. Mod should have speared that nigga that had the shotgun. <clears throat> uh, man, dog. like what like what? What do you do, bro? I feel like I feel like if, if it was 
if the nigga was any bigger, he would he would have won that shit. He was a, he was a small nigga. Man, like, I tell a, I, 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 he did what he was supposed to do, nigga. He went out. <laughs> oh yeah, like, you damn right he went, man, man, bro. Nigga on God. Oh, the nigga got shot. He got shot three times, bro. Two mo- on oh, two motherfuckers. He went out like a straight yeah, war. Your, your adrenaline, man, in a situation like that, bro, you you get shot. You're not bro. gonna feel that. Not right away. Not, not, right not, away. It's not especially especially not shotgun. This shit is it's bad. It's not it's not going straight through him. Here's some shit. I let that head slow. Well, I hope they hang them up. Probably not. Man. I but damn it, I, but in Georgia, yeah. in Georgia, they can't. They don't have the uh, hate crime law, so they can't charge them with a hate crime, which is fucked up. Which is a federal crime. So they can't even charge with a federal crime. I but. thought murder was a crime regardless of what the fuck it was, though. Yeah, no, it's not. But yeah, but it's a. It's not. It's not a federal crime. Though. Hate yeah. crime is, is like a terroristic crime. It's like a terror. It's, it's, it's equal to terrorism. Any time, crime. Any time a white person kill a black person, that's a hate crime, bro. What the fuck? Especially the way he did it, bro. Listen, though. How y'all, I, I, y'all? Well, somebody was recording, and then they parked in front of him, and oh, who goes there? Motherfucker, we're on the, we're on the open street. And it shows that before that happened, they were chasing the man down the street, and the, the person, the, the 911 person was like, what are they doing wrong? And the nigga, he, didn't, he never answered that. He never answered what they're doing wrong. Does he have anything from the property? No, he, he Is, didn't answer that. He didn't have anything. That's crazy. We live they in the shot world that man because they wanted to, bro. We live in the world not because where they you had have to. to fear. You you have to fear people with pale skin. At least that's what the fuck they want you to do. I don't fear nobody. That's the thing. That's that's what they want. Like, hey, they don't want yeah, you to fear that. that. I think I think you're trying to pull me out. I'm trying nah, to hold please back. No, no, no. I'm trying no, to hold back. Hey, what are you talking about, show? We Bro, ain't that type of show, man. Now, Ronald, nigga. <laughs> Please, you got the mic, sir. Bro, them mean, mother, they they scared of us, anyway. It's been like this since the beginning of time. Bro. Talk about it. Yo, Please, so, so, on, so on, in the on, game, they they try to motherfucking brainwash us to think that we less than what we is. I don't yeah, even please. I don't even want to say better than them. I just say less than what we is. Remember that's why they kill the. That's why they kill the nigga you know that, that stand up to him and, and try to try to try to create a and, movement. You know right. what I'm saying? I don't want to Every say we better than shit like that, but I'm we, we definitely better than what the fuck we is right now. What you know what I'm saying? So man. definitely equal, nigga. Definitely equal to them niggas. It's it's real. Man. It's real. That shit deep. That's real deep. Bro. I can go on. You know. <laughs> no, nah, it's crazy bro. though. And it's crazy it's though because like. Cause like I was so I was so heartbroken at this situation because um people was quarantined and all I kept hearing from everywhere, this is a good time to bond and you know, family time. I was hearing all of that, right? And I thought I was like, you know, they got a point. Nigga them Jordans came out, one store opened up, bro, and they was right back bullshitting fighting. And I got to thinking like Black Brain people really wise. fucked up like that to not want nothing more than a pair of high price ass motherfucking shoes. Bro, I told you about the story about the about the nigga uh, that shot the shot the security guard in the face of Dollar General, my nigga. My God. What? Because because yeah. she, because he he asked her to put the, the, uh, a mask on her daughter. Right, Carl. They got they got an argument. Nigga, she left, came back. Husband came back, shot the motherfucking security guard, bro. Do y'all have? At do a dollar know, fucking general, bro. Do y'all know what's going on <laughs> in y'all on, state man. with regulations to what they trying to do for the kids in school? No, man. I don't know. Well, I, I ain't really heard about it. Uh, they ain't was reading, it, man. They just Tasha they was they, reading something to me earlier about all the stuff that they trying to do, bro. And this is gonna be a problem. Yeah. What they trying to do? Bro? I mean, just just how they trying to. Um, you know, make kids wear masks. How they trying to tell you to dress them, and you know, basically they taking away being a human. Like, motherfucker, this is allergy season. Motherfuckers gonna sneeze a lot around this time. Freshly cut grass, pollen, and they were saying like some places, nail places, talking about if you sneeze, they gonna ask you to leave. Like it's all kind of shit. But but the school thing, I'm I'm gonna get. 
I'm gonna get the the whole list of things, but that's just here in Davidson County. They 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 um they merging like three schools, bro, and talking about a twenty five million dollar budget cut. So I said, bro, how the fuck is that gonna make sense? How y'all gonna have a twenty five million dollar budget cut, which cuts out teachers, hella five teachers, but you gonna merge the schools? This is only happening in the black neighborhood. You gonna merge? Uh, you course. gonna merge the nigga- school? Merge the school and take away the resources. Like you gonna you gonna give them less Bruh. teachers and more students. Bruh, and merge the school and crowd the, crowd the classes. So, so that's a, we'll and, then, that shit. and how you gonna get more people in a, in in one building and try to keep them as far away from each other as With possible? Shitty testing, nigga, nigga. We ain't got no vaccine for the shit. The whole, hold on, bro. Come on, bro. I don't need, look, bro. I ain't gonna lie to you. I don't believe in those. I don't trust the pharmaceutical company and doctors enough to believe that they not giving me something that I don't necessarily need. Right. All right. Even if you don't believe in vaccine, because, we, ain't got, we don't have nothing to treat this shit like that. But listen, let me ask you this: ain't treatment, no treatment for it right now. Do you consider a treatment a a a a, a, a small portion of a cure? No, because just, the, the you're, only, not, this, not, you're not curious of the virus. You, you just treat it exactly. But this one, this is what I'm asking you that they said that this virus is more like the flu, right? No, it's no, more this like is, pneumonia. No. More like, more like pneumonia. 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 Okay, pneumonia. It's like a, mu- so, a mutated pneumonia. Pneumonia. Do you know? Do you know what the cure to pneumonia, uh, pneumonia is? There's no cure. No. It's therapy. Okay. So if there's no cure for pneumonia and this is just like pneumonia, then how would they be able to treat that? Because they would probably have to take but see, the it's same different. Though. See, that they no, take no. to treat pneumonia, right? Pneumon- but see, no, no, no. The, pneumonia is caused by pneumonia is caused by um, um, infection liquid, in the lungs. Liquid, right, right, infection, but it's, it, but it's, it's moisture in the lungs. The the I'm just co- telling the, you the definition the, of pneumonia. No, no, I'm just saying I got you. Appreciate that. But the corona, <laughs> <laughs> the coronavirus causes pneumonia. But the virus, the virus itself, gets in the lungs, it's respiratory. and it's, it's, it's also respiratory. showing respiratory. But it's all, it's also doing other shit in kids. I don't know, I don't know exactly, but it's, it's causing um, it's like multiple inflammation, some shit. But it's, it's it's a new study that they found in kids. It's in nine year old boys, yeah. So I gotta watch my son. Now. That's what I'm saying, bro. Crazy, that's though, because they were just bro. saying kids was the ones that wasn't gonna get the shit. Now, right, yeah. right. And that's what I'm saying. The shit, the shit is changing now, so fast. <clears throat> It's changing. I don't but, like the way this sounds. It, it don't oh, sound good at all. Mu- it's, it's mutating. It, 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 it's, 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 it's already too, but think about it. In New York, there was a European virus. On the, on the West Coast in California, Seattle, that shit was the fucking Chinese virus from Wuhan. Two separate viruses, but two separate um, ways that they uh, uh, change and shit, mutate. And this is what happened, Affected, man. When you shit is crazy. with shit. Bro, this is what happened when we got a dumbass president, bro. Okay. For real, though. Let me explain this. Hold when on I one second, sir. I don't, I don't think you can just blame the no. president. Check this out. Hell yeah. Let me explain this. All right. When, when, when Darius was going to the hospital, and you know he had the trait. Okay. The doctor said one, one is a virus and one is a bacteria. Okay. So... Yeah. Viruses, they can't treat. What they do is, like they, they used to tell us, they it have to run its course, but they're going to do everything right. to keep you saying. comfortable. But with bacteria, they can give you antibiotics, antibiotics and clear right. it out. Right. Yeah. The coronavirus is a virus. So right. it have to run its course. So you got treatment. to treat it. There's yeah. no cure for it. It's treatment. The only thing they can See, give you is... Is fluids. You gotta get right. fluids, and you right. know. The thing is, though, the yeah. thing is, though, it's it's based on how healthy you is. Right. It's right. Of course. Yeah. It's on healthy you is, cause cause they not talking about the survival people. That's that's uh the rate of uh uh survival rate. Yeah, bro, right. going, like, that's catching it, and, and, and not ain't nothing wrong. You know what I'm saying? Right. They, they, they ain't talking they said, about but they that. Said, they it's saying they saying they saying it might it might be it might they, they, like most of us probably already have it already or have Tight it already. Shit. Not me. Asymptomatic. <laughs> I'm just saying. That's what they're saying. Like most of us probably already had. It. I think. I think that's an excuse for the government. But hey, man, I, I, I think 
It, I mean, it could be. I'll, die, I'll, could die, be I'll die being a smart, ignorant <laughs> motherfucker. Bro, I think that shit, I, I, honestly, I honestly believe that that shit is, I mean, I know people getting sick. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not saying that that shit is just completely fake, but I have to let go. Like when it comes to stuff like that, I have to look at that shit the exact same way I look at religion, man. I have to. And the only reason why I, the only reason why I have to look at it like that is because since I was, since I was a kid, my, my parents used to always show me that something dramatic happens every year of presidency. Every year, a year of an election, that is some crazy happens. So, you know, um, and I don't know, bro, I guess I just had to be the one that's an example made up for not believing that, that that shit is as serious. Why? Because they not talking about, um, you know, they're not making, they're not balancing out people's emotions. They're not telling people it's a high chance that you can really survive this too. shit. They're not saying that. They're just saying, this how many people got it, and this amount of people is dying, making that shit seem so bad. But like, y'all know, oh, my God, if you already like taking care of yourself to a decent degree, then you'll be cool. Yeah, but see, that's, that, I, 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 that's, higher. that's what they I think, know. though, but this, like I said, this, the fact that we the fact that we shut down for six weeks is is, is the reason why it didn't spread the, 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 the way that was it was. That was about money right there. That was all about shut down. What oh. please? That was that, that was oh, well, they, they pockets got so fat off that bro. Off the little, up the down these companies and stuff, man. Oh, you talking about like Walmart and shit like that? All all these companies, Walmart, H E B, all the grocery stores, all of them, because because all the even even like you see like motherfuckers like essential essential workers and shit. Them motherfuckers, bro. Look, all these little businesses shutting down. All these little businesses shutting down, man. You know all their revenue still going somewhere else is going to them. They jumped Damn, up tremendously. That's a good fucking point, nigga. This they jumped up tremendously, bro. Target, all the, all, the, all, the, all the motherfucking businesses the nigga had on the stage with him. Man. Target, Walmart, Man. Damn, that's a good motherfucking point. Hey, bro, they paid off this. And that's they ain't, the government ain't got to sh- pay them shit because it's huh. we, we, yeah, yeah, shut down because of the coronavirus. Nigga. Damn, they got, up, their, they got their check. They got a stimulus check too. They don't have to pay back. Man, so, but they, yeah, but their business still going. They, 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 they business they going, and they, going, and they still coming out winning at the end of the day. That's a lot of money, and look how long it's still going on. You yeah. know what I'm saying? This they, is they, this this. Ronald Trump and um, I just want to let the world know that these Negroes are God. They they got it. They're smart. <laughs> check it out, Ronald. What the it. hell do you have to lose? I think we're doing hey, you ain't slick neither, Ronald. Cause look, you gave us the first check and we gave it back. Cause you left the right. essential job token, my nigga. That's not. That's one. That's one. Oh, man, the Democrat. Now the Democrat trying to give us another one. Wait a minute. Because this is election year type shit, so you don't want to be outdid. But we know what you did. You gave us the checks and we gave it right back. You gave it right back. You know, it's so. For a favor. I do one for okay. you. You do one back for me. <laughs> and nigga, you up on the this, you country, you. This, great, this great nation was built on the barter system. Eye for an eye. I do for you. You do for me. If anything, you, if anything, be thanking me. My nigga, we was out of work <laughs> because of your ass. Yeah. You yeah, yeah, yeah. But yeah. Ronald, why could you just why, but cancel you rent? Gave some of you. I gave you money. I you canceled gave, rent. Some of you were still getting paid. And we gave you some money. I still pay my rent. We every gave month, you so right back. We gave you back to your businesses and shit. You and your guys. <laughs> you and your guys. I pay my rent. You know, at a time like this, I don't think we should point fingers. I think we the bright side to everything. Nigga, they, you been pointing at China and Obama since the shit started, my nigga. What the fuck you talking about? Things China are opening. Things That's are trying to take it out. Right. The economy is about to be better than it's ever been. And when I say better, I mean amazing better. So much better, you're going to be able to buy LeBron's with your gas money. That's how big it is. something been planned. So, so, That's so, so, Mr. President, are, are you saying are you saying that the gas prices are going to be that high also? Shit, they going back up. Yeah. Right. <laughs> Shit. 
Shut up, man. Yeah. That's that nigga. <laughs> a little high. You hear me? That little ass too. That poor. That poor. You see where that? You see where that? that I can. You were sitting where I can buy LeBrons with the gas money that I have. So you're yeah. saying that the gas prices are going to be $120, $150. What I'm saying is... Per gallon. What I'm saying is the price of LeBrons are going to go down. <laughs> yeah. To $125 <125 laughs> per pair, nigga. <laughs> I need the gas price right now for LeBron, nigga. 147 per pair. Gas is going to be this high <laughs> until we get another refinery built. One blew up. You know how these things work. It's a bit. <laughs> In about a month, gas will be down. I can't guarantee, but I can guarantee that they'll go down. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. You can't guarantee, but you guarantee? <laughs> Hell no. Don't you remember when you said people are dying that have never died before? <laughs> yeah. I remember yeah. that. I remember that. I remember yeah. that. So, it is true. It is true, so though. <laughs> Technically. <Yeah. laughs> I was thinking when I... Though, yeah. I was thinking like that. He was stupid when he said the shit. Bro, I, I started to text the nigga like, bro, where you get that, where you get that uh, sauce from, bro? Because that shit... Wait, bro, you, bro, you really just saying people dying that ain't died before? <laughs> I, can't, I can't get the black boat with you saying stupid shit like that. Yeah. Yeah, niggas, niggas told niggas just drink bleach and shit though too, bro. So like, what do you expect from this nigga, bro? He said, "Do what? To drink or, or or inject disinfectants into your body?" You know, you know he he said you know he asked taking a, a doctor um, on camera. He asked her. He said, "Hey, do you think we could look into injecting uh, disinfectants into the body?" And she was like. I don't know that to be a treatment. And she, he was like, okay. Look, this man is literally, literally suggesting to inject disinfectants. You ain't heard about this shit, bro? No, this man literally said that it's Donald Trump, bro. Not Ronald Trump. Donald Trump, the president of the fucking United States, bro. This nigga is a horrible human being, bro. This nigga is trash, bro. He don't care about nothing. He cares about getting reelected, bro. He wants, he wants to open the country back up. So we can get everybody back to work, get the economy boosted back up. So you can get that, that. So he has a reason, something to talk about, other than and, the shitty, the shitty job he did with the pandemic. But you look it's still up, going on. But look, y'all gotta understand that man is. He has been showing how much power he has and how much of a joke this country is when he started running for president. Yep. Bro. Yep. Right. Right. On oh, Jesus. Like, like at this point, motherfuckers can dislike a lot of stuff that he do and say, but bro, that man way too powerful to be stopped. That's right. why he's president. Four more years, it should be over with. But, but we, but then we're gonna have to be like, well, damn, who the fuck gonna come top this bullshit? Right. Big shoes, man. He making Obama look so much better though, cause it's like, god damn, boy, you, you. You just the idiot. <laughs> the whole fucking. For real. Like I said, bro, when you, when you, when you, when you, because I got into politics when, when Obama got elected. So when I sit back and realize, I'm like, okay, Obama is a pawn. You know what I'm saying? All presidents are just pawns, bro. They can't get shit done. And they change. They change just because, you know what I'm saying? That's what a president is, bro. They have to bend and, you know what I'm saying, flex to their donors. But that's what it is. That's what politics is, bro. So when I realized that, I'm like, there's no, there's not going to be. A good president. Nobody should be president. Bro. It shouldn't be a fucking president because nobody's fit to that job. Ronald Trump, 2020. <clears throat> Shit. I think I think we shouldn't have one person running the country. I think we should have like different people from different where well, you can do all 50 states, elect one person, like a governor or whatever, and everybody come together and they vote on different shit and they give their own opinion and all this shit. We shouldn't have one person just. I can, you know sign, I can sign an executive order, and you know this shit ain't gonna go through. No, you know no. have a person doing that. That's because they they, they say they're gonna do all this and that and the third, but and they might do that. They might do everything they say, Man, but it's a whole it. bunch of other shit that, that you don't even know about that's gonna counteract and do everything to the shit that they did do good. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. 
Yeah. It might not even happen right away. It might happen some years oh, later. Oh, you know? while we talking about politics, public service announcement from Ronald Trump. Black folks, you need to pay attention to the legislators that you vote in office. Mm -hmm. Because a lot of people really seem as if the president is the biggest vote they count. No, motherfucker. The people who make the laws, which are called legislators, and they run in your city and you don't pay them no attention because they don't have the money to put behind their campaign to be on TV and all this other shit to make it look like they can really do something. Because the people with money can't even really do nothing as far as what they say they can and will do for you. So I just want to put that out there. Um, also, but also okay. to be fair, bro, they really, they really don't advertise. I know they, they shouldn't have to, but they really don't advertise when, when election days are and shit. They Listen, really should, they really should be like, you see fuck like Super Bowl ads and shit. But, but hold on though. The two <laughs> top running presidents, candidates, Bro, they they have all kind of commercials, paid actors. Oh, um, that's what I'm saying. But I'm bro, talking about for local, love for local events though. But what I'm saying is, bro, the, local the have a more effective job than the president. He's not a lawmaker. He signs off on them. Right, but he has more power. So that's what people. That's what people care about. You right, but here's the: you have power. I have brains. If I suggest something that just sounds good to you, boom. Now it looks like you've done something, but really I done it and I used you. That's what they that's what they do. That's what they the legend they put laws in place for their family at that point in time. Period. They'll pass a law that'll benefit their legacy and it's over with. But People right. don't, I'm not going to say people don't know, but they don't take that shit serious. You don't see lines of motherfuckers out trying to vote for Councilman 17 when he the I one that, you. Gonna, you know, get some shit going on in your neighbor. Like, my mom, I had a conversation with my mom. <clears throat> and, mom, if you listen to this, please don't, you know, don't, don't get too mad at me. But my <clears throat> mom had no idea that, that that shit mattered that much. That, that the legislators were the ones, you know what I'm saying? Fuck about politics to think about that. Right. So when I told her about it now, you know what I'm saying? Now she'd be like, well, maybe I should look at the councilman of a neighborhood before I go move into it. You know what I'm saying? See what they got moving. You know what I'm saying? Whatever. Blase, blah. Ronald Trump in the flesh. But yeah, just period. So make sure y'all uh, do some research on these folks and do not vote for somebody who is not in your community really doing what they say they gonna do after they get your vote because that shit fuck that bro it's a dude in nashville been trying to run for i forgot what the fuck he been trying to run for but his his history is so fucked up like bro you got fired from two schools you know and <laughs> it was, it, but, it, but see that's the thing though but it doesn't matter bro trump got trump had how many bankrupt bankrupt businesses how many? How many paid off? Point? If people don't give a fuck. If you can, if you can deliver the message, that's all that matters, though. That's all that matters, bro. Your mind you can, manipulating type. You can persuade bro. people that that's you can do a better is, job man. than other person. That you, that, that, bro. You bro, people, bro, people weak, bro. He probably making people think they fucked up some shit that he know he fucked up. Right. With this, <laughs> either being, either being, you know, ignorant or intimidated, it, it, it just played out in his favor. This nigga ain't turned in no tax return paper for these folks in three years, and he's still able to run the country. Power. Matter of fact, still I was in courts right now, nigga, to get was, a uh, tax return release. Um, day, and he referenced Donald Trump, and this was way back in Thug Motivation, first GZ CD. I n't even know about Donald Trump back then. Right, I, I know that line. Man. Well, what's the line? Hey, shit, that nigga got his own listen, country man. over there. That nigga got his yeah. own country, own currency. You see you know how much he don't get recognized for that, bro? He is doing a lot. Yeah, bro. A he lot. In my hood coming black. No, no. Hey, I'm, Con, I'm mixing up with a jet. Then Trump done for America. Hold on, tell me this. Tell, tell me G's currency. song, bro. Yeah, I, I, know, I, gotta hey. tell, I gotta tell you the line, bro. You know, America mad at that. You know, America mad at that because they got they... Day currency everywhere. 
but he got his own currency type shit. You see what I'm saying? They gonna that's gonna be an issue down the line. Bullshit you not. I said it first, Joe Jap. It's gonna be an issue down the line. Watch. Watch. And what issue is there? Give it to him. I don't know. Is it gonna be about some money? It's always about some money. Oh, who, 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 who you mean got their own they, currency? What you mean? They, they, kind of them. they got their own currency. Oh, he got his own little Oh, no currency. shit. Yeah, bro. Bro, you, you got to know that. Oh, shit. They come no, I, knew that. I knew they had their own currency. They, 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 they yeah, bro. bro. It's going to be a problem down the line. I don't know how soon. If that shit continue to flourish over there, it's going to be a problem down the line if America can't get their hand in their pocket. I'm telling you. They want their hand in everybody's shit. That's me. That's the auto war. That's what everything is about wars and shit. Even this little corona virus. We know this shit created. So it's all about money, man. Come on now. Yeah. It's, yeah. it's all about money. Motherfuckers getting mad. You don't know what the hell going on behind them scenes. Like we on the phone talking this shit. They probably like, fuck you, motherfucking goddamn. This, this. You don't see all that shit when they talking to these other motherfucking prime ministers and shit like that and emperors, wherever the fuck you call the motherfuckers over there. They don't know. You don't know how that conversation is. You just know what we right. get on. And tell us, you know what I'm saying? We tried to do this, and then that. They didn't bow. They didn't bow down to us. Basically, basically, so. I cussed the motherfucker out, told him I come kill him, all his people, and now we got to go to war. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Straight like that, bro. My that's, brother, that's how I mean. To me, my brother love that shit. My brother was like, "Yeah, nigga, America go jump in everybody business, and then bullet that way in the land." They were like, "These motherfuckers, some." Italy are getting to it with Sweden. Or, uh, uh, and then America come in and be like, hey, Sweden, we'll knock a couple of them niggas off, man. You know what I'm saying? What y'all? What's yeah, up, guys? That's then what they, you heard about. Yeah. Just, just, just let us put a camp right here so our people can come woo woo. And then, right. Right. Damn, and then come over there and they take get, over it. They here. They can't get That's rid of old school conquering. That's old school medieval conquering, European bro. style, bro. Come nah. on. Bro, that shit happened recently, bro. Last year in Venezuela, bro. They tried come to on, have man. this dude. Nicholas Maduro, they tried, they tried, they tried, they, nigga, they plan to kidnap this nigga and take us to Miami and kill him. What? They plan to kidnap, but, but they can't, they plan to kidnap a president of Venezuela. Take this nigga to Miami and kill this nigga, bro. That was the plan, dog. Like, wait, is there, who planned on doing that? These guys? Is there, is there, yes. They reported that Bill Barr planned, planned to go and, and kidnap this nigga. And take a Miami and kill a nigga and, and, and have they already had a replacement and everything. But so they had they had a cool they had a cool a cool setup already. The shit did the shit that they they didn't have a chance to kidnap him. So they um but but the US they were like, we will if we have to use military action. But what? Nigga, what that's not our problem. But they made it look like it was it was just, you know, saying the 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 citizens and and the the, the other dude. That was going. To, that, no, nigga, it was it was U.S. back. That shit ain't like that. Ain't that easy, bro? They so fucked up. Fucked up. And the shit we, Joe, we 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 appreciate you coming on the show, man. Oh, we need a part two. For real though, definitely. Always. We man. need a part two, man. I let yeah, bro. Be, you know, always, I'm always. Bro. I can a lot, lot more. Man, you know already. You know, we didn't even get to the death. But, you know. Nigga, don't, nigga, don't be scared to get deep, bro. Nigga, we, we, bro, we go there. You know what I'm saying? We with it. <laughs> going to, what we're going to do is we're going to um, uh, um, promo the part two. Because this is nice. It was nice having you, my brother. Always. I ain't kicking you off the show at all. Yeah. Yo, with the wing on that, you know, no goddamn questions, but you were more than welcome to stay and kick it with us, you know. All day, man. You know, I'm gonna be old, you know, watching this shit. Always invite me. <laughs> uh, yeah. You I want to have you, nigga, Kendall, shit. man. Kendall, dog. Hey, hey, man. God, man. I miss that part of the show, unless you speak Morse code. Yeah. Good gotcha. boy. Good <laughs> boy. What be going on with the nigga phone on the Zoom? But yeah, man. Y'all niggas holler at me, man. All right, yeah, man. Appreciate it, man. Yeah. Yeah. on through, man. You be good, bro. All day. Yeah, yeah. Hey, boy. I feel you. I feel. 
Afi. Afi. Hey, man. Part <laughs> two, man. I, we might got to do a three. Fuck you, man. <laughs> bro, that was sad, dog. Damn. I ain't on, bro. I, I didn't know I had this. This is fun right here, boy. That yeah, shit, yeah. hey, you, you, you with the shit with that junk too, boy. Hey, shit. I don't know. sit on and it just, it just turned me, put me in character. Yeah, I'm, I'm finna, I'm finna get my little, I'm finna get my little, my little, what's it called, a little swivel shit, cause I can have my little shit out here just. Silver? What's up? Nah, my little swivel shit, like, you know what I'm saying? Oh, your mic. Yeah. Like, my up. Yeah, what up, man? What's going on with you? My <laughs> oh, you be having that junk hooked up? Yeah, it ain't hooked up. Now I'm using my phone now, but I'm getting a All camera right. sometime. I need to get a camera for my shit. All right, I'm going to clean out this goddamn utility room, and I'm going to go back there, so I won't have to hit nobody. Oh. <laughs> oh. Yeah. oh. Who's going to fuck you all today, ladies and gentlemen? Today, I have somebody that's going oh. on the Wow. Hey, right, hold on, hold on, hold on, Gonna, uh, hold on, okay? Let me pass the Going too far. Favorite. Career takeover yeah, for me. You see, all right. I'm going to start this out real nice. You know what I'm talking about? I'm going to start off with Ross. Ross, do you have anybody you want to put on the Fuck you, Ross. Damn. I don't know, bro. Not really. Hey, right. it can be something, somebody. <laughs> You know, your nail, if your nail broke it and made you mad, put that motherfucker up there. If man, you, you know drop the, get your boy. Yeah. Huh. Man, it was some, it was some fly, it was a whole bunch of flies outside in the trash yeah. can, my nigga. Hey. I had to walk to my car, nigga, you know what I'm saying? I had to, feel me, but I had, a, I had a pretty good day, bro. I ain't gonna lie, bro. The flies was the only thing, you feel me? So fuck them flies, bro. <laughs> Hey, you feel me? Fuck them and, I'm getting, real talk, and I'm getting a haircut tomorrow, nigga. So you know what I'm saying, bro. Golly, yeah, I, I'm, let, I'm, let, I'm, you know, what I'm, 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 I'm finna get dreads, bro. But the little thinning spots, they, they ain't. This shit is thick as a fuck on the side, and it's thin on top. So I'm gonna go ahead and get my little, you know what I'm saying, get my little taper fade tomorrow. Gotta so look clean. <laughs> yeah. For a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, feet. Yeah, yeah. So. So are you, putting, Ross. are you putting the, the my bad, go ahead, Poop Art. <laughs> my my brother God, Ross no put the flies <laughs> on the fuck you wall. So you know what I'm saying? In under in honor of my brother Ross. You know what I'm saying? Brandon Rowling. Can we get a good fuck you to the fly? One, a two, a three. Oh, fuck, fuck you. you. Fuck you. Fuck you, fuck you, fuck you. Fuck you. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> you know, moving right along, I'm going to pass this to my brother from another mother in color. Uh, Monterey Jerome in the house. Gooch. Take it away. I mean, uh, Donald Trump. Ronald Trump. <laughs> yeah, him. And on today, on the fuck you wall goes the old couple that was playing golf in the rain and hit their motherfucking ball at me. <laughs> first That's ball. fucked up. I ain't laughing at you, but it's fucked up. <laughs> them. First of all, we're going to put them on them. Yeah. Hold on, y'all. I, I can't cuss. Hold, give me one second. Yeah, she. <laughs> this is funny, man. Look at him. He's talking that shit. He ain't got the mic. He still got the mic right there. <laughs> Look. <laughs> right. I ain't got the mic on. It's a furious Ronald Trump. Uh, Ronald Trump, as he is yeah. irate at his children, it seems to be. Yeah. It seems to be. He seems to be yelling and. Somebody <laughs> threw something. Oh my god. <laughs> Where is the Secret Service when he needs them? Yeah. Looking at. Hey, fast nigga. Yeah. <laughs> nigga was involved involved in the assault, wasn't it? What you mean? <laughs> <laughs> I 
you know, sometimes I wish I can put my kids on this wall, you know, but I love them. <laughs> <laughs> like I would. Motherfuckers hit the ball at me, man. That ain't no. Um, the goddamn potato killers is up. And they look like those killer hornets that they was talking about that just came here from China. So they got to go on. And that's it. I'm, I'm cool with everything else. So them cicadas and them old people. Fuck y'all, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, I feel you. I understand where you're coming from, but uh, so you know. Hey, I'm, 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 let, me, let, me just, let me let me just tag on that real quick. Just for all together for all of us. We want to say, say just fuck Kimdale Wi-Fi. That's what we want to say one time. That shit gonna yeah. stay on the wall. Hey, yeah. put that shit on the wall. I'm gonna get a goddamn sticker. We gotta put it on the wall. Kim Kim Dale Dale. Fuck it. Motherfuckers causing a problem. <clears throat> you fuck your Wi Fi. You hear me? No, I'm telling you, I race no flakes. We feel your pain. Uh, but yeah, my brother Uno said, you know, the old ass people, they hit their balls, you know what I'm saying, at him. And, um, <laughs> goddamn uh, killer, goddamn Wallace, what the fuck they Cicada is? killers. Yeah, whatever the fuck it is, the big motherfucker that fly. Yeah. Mm. Uh, <laughs> <but> yeah. <laughs> uh, mm. Can we get a one, a two, a motherfucking three? Fuck you, you, you racist motherfuckers. 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 <laughs> Blue like wing gas bug. But yeah. Um, <laughs> all right, today, uh, this shit might sound crazy, but I want to put myself on the fuck you wall. You know what I'm talking about? Because, uh, um, talk about it. An uh, ugly ass nigga. You know what I'm talking about? Me as myself, ugly as hell. Little booty, big draw, tight jeans, little shirt, big kids, <laughs> whole body, little chin ass nigga. <laughs> they lost the motherfucking car charger in the car. I done to my work truck up, you know what I'm saying? I know I put this shit up in there, you know what I'm saying? So when I got back to work on my second stop, I went to the car, unlocked the door, you know what I'm saying? Hit the little button, the shit raised up. I see the car charger in there. And I said, you got to be one of the dumbest motherfuckers I know. <laughs> but yeah, uh, so anyway... <laughs> I would like to put my ugly, you know what I'm saying, thin hair, you know what I'm saying, uh, wreck head down, frown looking ass. Yeah. Fucking fuck you, wow. So, can we get a, a one? Bro, I don't feel comfortable two. saying this shit, bro. I think. Yeah. Fuck you. <laughs> fuck you. Yeah. Thin eyebrow ass nigga. Tight socks. Oh man! Loose toenail ass nigga. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, man. Yeah, yeah, man. You know what I'm talking about? Damn. Yeah, shit made me mad, man. It was too early. Yeah. It was too <laughs> early. <laughs> 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 Shout out to, to Jasper, aka Joe Jep. Yeah. Really? Yeah. Oh man, that was, was pretty cool having him come through. You know, he tripped. He wasn't on no weird shit. We appreciate it, and um. You know, he will be back. We do have a part so. coming, and for so that nigga might be a recurring guest and shit. And so might be a like guest, a motherfucking if, uh shit. Guest, <laughs> we ain't out to your ass if you want to be a guest. You don't have to let us know you're trying to be a guest. But yeah. also, I do got Tay Williams coming next week, man. Uh, this lady I know that uh beat cancer. She want to and encourage you first to all the people battling cancer. Yeah, shout, out yeah. shout out to her. Shout out to her. Shout out to anybody fighting cancer right now, man. Too. Yeah, man. <sighs> yeah, I, I got some. I got some. I can't. I can't say it because I, I, I was told with confidence, but I got somebody personally that's fighting, uh, fighting cancer right now. So, well, we, yeah, bring to them to get cancer. Fuck cancer. Cancer got to go and fuck you off for shit. Sure. Shit, man. Fuck cancer, man. Fuck cancer. Put cancer up there. Yeah, Wi-Fi got to stay up there. Yeah, you got to stay up there, man. <laughs> it's right below cancer, though. 
man. What's below? Yeah, Wi Fi. We put that bitch. We put that bitch on top of it. <laughs> that shit on top. And if you gotta go up there. Look, I know I'm about to get off topic. I know it just seemed like the shit only fuck up on Zoom, bro. His lives be perfect. Yeah. Well, maybe I know, bro. I'll be serious. Versus the area he work in is different. He might work in the city and live in the country. <laughs> hey, look, because I saw he was on Facebook yeah, Live after we got off the, when, uh, on Monday. Khadija. Khadija. And it was cool. Well, ladies and gentlemen. It might be just cause of cause of Zoom, bro. I don't know. That this 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 kinda this kinda concludes our show, you yeah. know. Hundred Hundred you know, today's <laughs> show. Although we winged that son bitch, it was cool because we made that shit happen. Again, yeah. shout out to Wi-Fi. Kendall still pulling up, rest no flesh, get shot in the neck. Respect. That's still my. Shout but, out. Yeah, shout out. Shout out to Kendall. Yeah. I want to yeah. shout out to all our moms. Shout out to all yeah. our kids. You yeah. know, yeah. shout yeah. out to everybody that we actually love for real. You know what yeah. I'm saying? Shout out to all. Jada, Avery, Brandon, Daddy, love you. Bro, I got to give a special shout out to Solo. <laughs> Everything. Oh. Yeah, so I want to shout out to them boys. Hold on, bro. You, you just cut out, bro. Your shit breaking up. What? You breaking you up. Been, you, you was cutting out, bro. Am I cutting out right now? No, nah, nah. you good, man. Follow us on Instagram at the Fat Show 08 on Facebook, Fat Show, Muhlenberg Chronicles, and where else we at, Ross? The uh, f dot a dot t dot show on uh, YouTube and on Twitter at Fat Show Eight, Instagram and uh, Facebook Fat Show Eight. Subscribe, like, comment, <laughs> feedback. Let us know what's Please. going on. Life if you want us to talk about it, but before we go, I gotta tell y'all something funny. I got a partner called me from prison. To tell me I was I had bad parenting. Let my kids listen to the top six nine. All right, we got past that part. This man got to telling me that he woke up now. He woke up at five forty five to set up a, a, a he to set up a corner in his cell to block him away from being seen, so he could watch porn. Now, now look. Now after he after he got his whole little tent set up, draws down, dick out, <laughs> then people came in there and opened his cell. Now he said he had a cellar that worked. So when his cellar went to work is when he got was trying to get busy. Said them folks came in there and messed up his whole little session. Said he had to pull his drawers up without even sticking his hand down there. It was crazy. But <laughs> They went in. They went in the cell because his cellar got caught with four phones and fifteen cartons of cigarettes. Now huh. I know where the fuck was he gonna put fifteen cartons of cigarettes? I don't know. But being greedy, my man couldn't even bust a nut. So my man, Damn. I hope you can handle your wax in due time. I know it's hard out there. You be home in a couple years. And I told him I was gonna tell this story on the show, but I ain't gonna say his name. He gonna listen. Cause he listened. To <laughs> so if y'all niggas shout out, y'all nigga, man. Shout that nigga out, man. Damn, that's fucked up, bro. Hey, shout out Brim. Niggas know who the Brim is. Shout out to Brim. Hey, hey. Like my hey. nigga used to say, while like he was locked up, when he trying to hit the bitch. <laughs> yeah. they call it hitting the bitch, man. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Yeah. Nigga gonna tell me he already hit Pinky. I hit the bitch, nigga, on the phone. Yeah. Wow. Hey, man. That nigga free. Shout out my man. That nigga free. God damn. Wait <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, that concludes the fast show, man. I am your host today. Mr. Ronald Chump. 
hailing in from downtown Cashville, Tennessee, baby. And I got my boys with me. My nigga Kendall shit dropped out. Fuck his Wi-Fi. Rex no flex. Get shot in the neck. Over respect. Shout out to him. He's still Chill. more special. Chill. I Chill. don't really mean shit, you know, from Tuskegee, Alabama. Y'all know Chill. what it is. I got my boy Big B representing yeah. Beach, Broward County. Shit. Yeah. This next on the right quick. Hurricane fan. Y'all don't know oh. what it is. Shit. Throw it up one time. And, you know, before we dip up out of here, you know, I got to give a <laughs> type for my nigga, you know what I'm saying? My brother, <laughs> brother from another color, Crip Walk on him, Cub. You know what it is, Raymond Street. You know what I'm saying? Cute Raymond money. Raymond Avenue. Ra Raymond Avenue. Get it right. <laughs> right that shit then, Cubs. Raymond Avenue. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah 12 <laughs> Yeah, All man. The, you know what I'm saying, my nigga? Orange Mound Finest. Orange Mound C Street, right there by the orange store. Yippee. <laughs> Your yeah, favorite creep. Yeah. Who pot? <laughs> I can hear the crowd going crazy for us. We know y'all love us. It's all right. good. Right. Y'all follow <laughs> us as we go places. Until next time, love, love everybody, man. Peace and blessings. God is real. Love is everything. Yeah, thing. Real though. Ah. <laughs> You're loving it. Nigga. <laughs>